Right, hello there everyone, welcome back to James Redman TV and no, this is not a Scouse porno because I've got my top off. This is the Liverpool versus Chelsea match vlog and I'm getting ready basically. This is the start of the video, or should I say the intro of the video, where I kind of give like my score prediction and stuff. My tiles just fell off, I'm not going to lie. But anyway, let's get a little score prediction in before we leave. So I'm going to say... It's a difficult game, isn't it? They've got Lukaku, but we've got Virgil van Dijk, and they've got Tuchel, but we've got Jürgen Klopp, and they might have, like, friggin' half it, but we've got Mane and Salah. So I'm going to say Liverpool can win this, and I'm going to say we can do it 2-1. I got the Burnley prediction right, so Jesus, Lord, please let me get this one. And, uh, yeah, let's get into today's James and Edmund vlog. So we're ready to set off. Really excited about today, I'm not going to lie. I'm excited to meet everyone as well. Me mum. I swear she made me a little scrap. Oh, and she did. She's made me a little barbecue pulled pork sandwich to bring with me onto the game. So, buzzing about that. Gonna scram that on the way. And let's deal with this, yeah? Oh, 
Chelsea. 1 0 Chelsea. Fuck sake.
game. I thought I'd give a little match reaction at the end of these vlogs. When I'm not going to the games, I'll do the normal match reactions and stuff. Um, also with the watch-alongs. But what can I say? I mean, Chelsea, they go into this season as the second favourites to win the league, if not the favourites in a lot of people's eyes. They go into today's game the favourites and they done everything they needed to do. I have not got an issue with how Chelsea played, even when they went down to 10 men. It did kind of make me laugh to see the Chelsea fans celebrate in the way that they did. I know that you were down to 10 men and I know that a draw at Anfield isn't the worst, but to see the champions of Europe celebrating like that, for me at least, was, was rather embarrassing considering you only got a point. Um, I haven't saw the Rhys James decision, so I can't really give a proper, proper analysis on what whether it should have been a red or not. But I think 1-1, one, one, we just didn't deserve to lose that game. I think we should have, the, the fair result would have been us winning, but you can't take away Chelsea's good performance defensively. So even though I think we were the better team, they still done what they needed to do. So I think maybe a point could be fair. But I suppose it's good that I'm disappointed over a draw because, let's be real, Chelsea are very fucking good and a draw is not a bad result. Um, some fans probably would have bit your hand off for a draw before the game. I just don't like draws in general. I believe we could have won. And it is what it is. Mane was terrible. Absolutely, like, I, I thought he was poor today. I um, thought Salah done his job. I think Firmino, while he was there, didn't really offer much, which just happens. Um, Thiago came on, made a difference. Harvey Elliott, just, I love the fact he's getting more and more chances, but Believe me, people, he's only going to keep getting better. And all round, defensively, Lukaku done nothing. It might as well be in friggin' Ashley Barnes up front for Chelsea today because Lukaku didn't have a sniff. But yeah, we move, don't we? We move um, on to the next game, which I don't know at the top of me yet. But hopefully we get three points. Thank you for watching, people. Thank you to everyone who came over after the, after the game as well. And um, yeah, I'll see you all later. Peace.